So in this episode, it is a bit different. The thing is, uh, my microphone didn't work, so this is just the voiceover of the episode. And I might even speed it up, so I am pointing at some bases that I'm going to clear this episode or in the coming episodes. And also I will have to clear out some, or want to clear out some dark area and place some radar so that the pollution doesn't really spread into areas that I don't see so that the biters don't actually go near me and I guess I will speed up the video now and talk over it so now I will drive down a bit and look at what my defense should do Then I see that I have too many things in my inventory and also I might need more power poles and turrets. Navigating through these tight spots is always a bit difficult. I definitely need a lot of carbon steel beams and some copper wire I guess and other things, I guess copper cable maybe for both uh, the medium electric power pole and the large steel pylon. steel beams and these other steel um, things, rivets, are really similar so it's difficult to put them on one belt and not uh, be confused with it. Then I'm turning down the alert for purple science. And also for the concrete I need more gravel and silica or sand. So I have to put down more crushers and I hope the stone is enough. Filling everything with efficiency modules, of course, to avoid pollution and energy demand. Still not really enough silica, so I might have to build more gravel.
Okay, now I'm going to look at the forest trees and also see that there is no power pole at the moment, so I have to bring electricity over. And that's when I can start my radar project. I want to try to build a few more forest trees, but also then later just go to the left and place the power poles as far apart as possible. To actually use less resources of course and build all the radars that I need. Place the radar a bit prematurely and have to replace it again. The research sound is a bit funny in sped up mode, I think. Everything is a bit more fun if you speed it up and let the tone or pitch become quicker. So still a few radars to go and also I'm thinking about how far I want to go with my forestries. Later on I certainly will try to encapsulate the whole factory in forestries and air purification towers. But for now it's enough to just have this western side covered with radars. As long as the pollution doesn't spread too far to the west, I will be safe. So now all the area is uncovered except this little stretch, but it doesn't uh, matter to me at the moment. So now that I've come back I see that stone and gravel coming in is not as much. So I also change some prior priorities on the splitters. I guess that's when I looked at the spread of the pollution and where the biters were. Now I just built some electric crushers that I didn't really need at that point because I really need to build more stone. That's what I actually should do and that's what I eventually did. I just needed to path through somehow and also I wanted to empty that chest. And I'm of course slightly out of efficiency modules most of the time. Still need to get more cable and steel stuff for the power poles.
So now I realize that I can build this electric arc turret, but I need a lot of stuff for it. This carbon steel turret frame, and for that I need a gyroscope. And uh, I will have to fetch some ingredients for that. I will just build it manually because I don't want to set up factories right now. Because I only also want to try it out, so don't really know how useful these turrets are. Later I found out that I just slow down the enemies with that, so they are not really useful in killing them. Except of course if I have some turrets behind it and they don't get attacked because the, the uh, electric arc turret slowed the biters down a bit. So now I still need some batteries and electromagnetic coils or something like that. Batteries are quite easy to get. And I also have some in my inventory or in my power armor. And the emptied batteries will of course fill up in my inventory after the power armor has been used. Also, of course, I need more radars and later also some turrets for when I go exploring and killing the biters. And now I realize that I can get some accumulators going and build them up there. There were already some blueprints that haven't been built yet, so I can build that and also place some new blueprints. And I will help the bots, of course, because I'm a nice person. And because it's going faster that way. So now I'm looking at military science, there's gunpowder missing, and later I will realize that that's due to the fact that I'm not delivering as much carbon as I should. Now I'm looking where the carbon is used and where to find some in the future. That's the source of carbon so far. Just six crushes. I have very many places where wood is transferred to coal or transformed to coal. A lot of forestries of course. Still looking for the best place. And how the research is going obviously. There's some military science missing. So there is most of my coal production and some coal comes from these wood chips. Might still be more if I put some more charcoal kilns there. And I have to really look out for that I don't use up all the charcoal or that I don't... that I still have charcoal going to the south and to the north to provide the air purification towers. 
but now I decided to just build the crusher crushers here. Then I have to bring some coal over, of course. I think it's a mixed belt of coal and charcoal. And because I don't know what it is yet, I will just not let it go down in the crusher array on the top I have um, have a filter that decides whether it's coal or charcoal and only lets the charcoal go down and then I just add the carbon with a splitter and I didn't realize so far that I have misplaced some of the inserters so some of the machines aren't working yet. The chest is already empty. And I want to make sure that the stone is balanced. And get rid of some gravel and other stuff. Still want to build some electric clush crushers. Then I realized that I still have some of these iron rivets left. This is the end of this episode. You may tell me if you liked it this way. <laughs>